so excited to be with you today for Joyful Noise. Let's get started by making the sign of the cross together. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Through baptism, we are washed clean from sin and made fresh and new. How did you use water before you came today? Did you drink it? Or maybe you made something with it? Or if, you went like, if you're like me, I went swimming in it. Water is so important for us as living things. It is also a symbol for baptism and being a part of God's family. Each time you see water this week, remember Jesus and remember that through baptism, you are made fresh, new, and clean. Next, we're going to read Psalm chapter 100. Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful songs. Know that the Lord is God. It is he who made us, and we are his. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. Enter his gates with thanksgiving and his courts with praise. Give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good and his love endures forever. His faithfulness continues through all generations. In this part of Paul's letter to the Romans, he is trying to describe what it's like to be a part of Jesus' team. Teams wear uniforms, teams have cheers, teams follow the coach. As part of Jesus' team, we wear the uniform of a Christian. We cheer each other on and we follow our coach, Jesus. I'm going to read from Romans chapter 6, verses 1 through 11. So do you think that we should continue sinning so that God will give us more and more grace? No, we died to our old sinful lives. So how can we continue living with sin? Did you forget all that us, all of us became part of Christ when we were baptized? We shared his death in our baptism. So when we were baptized, we were buried with Christ and shared his death. We were buried with him so that we could live a new life, just as Christ had raised, has, was raised from death by the wonderful power of the Father. Christ died and we have been joined with Christ by dying too. So we will also be joined by him by rising from death as he did. We know that our old life died with Christ on the, Christ on the cross. This was so that our sinful selves would have no power over us and we would not be slaves to sin. Anyone who has died is made free from sin's control. If we die with Christ, we know that we also live with him. Christ was raised from death and we know that he cannot die again. Death has no power over him now. Yes, when Christ died, he died to defeat the power of sin one time, enough for all time. He now has a new life, and his new life is with God. In the same way, you should see yourselves as being dead to the power of sin and alive with God through Jesus Christ. Paul cheered the Romans on in faith. Who cheers you on? Is it your mom or your dad, siblings and friends? And how do you show others that you are a follower of Jesus? Do you be kind to others? Do you talk about Bible stories? When is it hard to follow Jesus? Maybe when you're sad or mad? What questions do you have about baptism and being made clean, fresh, and new?
next what we're gonna do is make a craft. So what you'll need for this is a coffee filter, washable markers, and some sort of spray bottle. What we're gonna do is you're gonna take your coffee fil filter and you're just gonna color it all over. Once you color it, you're gonna take your spray bottle or Gator bottle because I don't have one and just start to spray it. And to do that, you're gonna let it dry. Once, it dr once it's dry, you're gonna take it, squeeze it in the middle, and puff it out so it looks like this, like a bow. Then you're gonna take a pipe cleaner, wrap it around a couple times, and you can cut it shorter if you want shorter antennas. And when you're done, it should look like a butterfly. You can move the wings to make it look more like this, and just have it there. You can use these butterflies as a way to remember that we are free, like, with Jesus. Thank you for joining me today. It was so much fun. Um, but let's end in a prayer. God of new life, thank you for washing us clean in baptism. Thank you for making us part of Jesus' team. Help us live our Christian faith every day so people know we follow Jesus. Amen. Go in peace, love, and serve the Lord. Thanks be to God. Hey everyone, are you looking for a way to write your songs today and share God's love? Join us at Mother of Mercies on June 28, across the street to Chalk the Walk. The sidewalk, that is. There is so much money that's begging to be colored on. Let's see how much we can fill up. Sign up in the link below. Hope to see you there!